Well, just over a year after escaping from the Lauderdale County Detention Center with Assistant Director of Corrections Vicki White, Casey White is set to face a judge. Yes, yeah, sentencing hearing scheduled for today after White accepted a plea deal last month avoiding a murder charge in the death of Vicki White. News 19's Carmen Fuentes joins us now with what we can expect at today's hearing. Carmen? Yeah, Steve Kelly, when Casey White accepted that plea deal last month, he pleaded guilty to a first degree escape charge, but that plea deal came with a life sentence behind bars. This means there really isn't much for either side to argue at today's hearing. Now, oftentimes, the family of those victims will address the court and the defendants, but it's not clear whether or not that will happen today. Casey White will also have that opportunity to speak before his sentence is imposed. During his plea hearing last month, Casey told the court and Vicki's mother that they were in love. The two, of course, were on the run for 11 days before being found and chased by law enforcement in Evansville, Indiana. According to investigators, Vicki died by suicide as officers closed in on them. So just to recap, Casey White's already serving a 75 year term for a standoff, burglary, robbery, kidnapping and attempted murder charges from 2015. So again, last month when he accepted that plea deal where he admitted the first degree escape, that deal calls for a life sentence, but he is eligible for parole with this deal. News 19 will have reporters in Florence later this morning. You can follow that coverage on air, online and on the News 19 app.